Why do we read and write poetry? We read and write poetry because this is how we feel. We flood our minds with thoughts that can overflow a piece of paper until the only thing left is less weight off of our chests. We read poetry to connect each and every one of us like puzzles that come together to make one. We read and write poetry so we never feel alone or closed out or forgotten. We write to express our inner hearts that are only shouted out by judgment. We write poetry to express the solid pattern of why our hearts continue to beat and even why they continue to break. This is a form in which we live. We live through poetry. We take other people's thoughts and we breathe them in as if they are our lungs. We take other people's feelings and in the same way we feel their pain, happiness, sorrow, and doubt through the words in which they write. We write our feelings down just the same so those people feeling the same of us can sulk in the very memories we burned our lives into. This is how we become one. Poetry is our way of becoming one, by picking up the broken pieces we all leave behind and building them back into one. One of strength, one of hope, one of courage and maybe even of sorrow. But this, poetry, is how our hearts and minds move with our pencil onto our paper. Without it, we would be forever broken, forever lost and in doubt. But with it, our minds soar into the everlasting peace that we all dream of. This is why we read and write poetry, because poetry is love.